Hey, to poor, pathetic Greg? Hey, don't talk to her that way. Mom, you question the practicality mm -hmm. of me having approached Marissa. Well, I question the practicality of my husband's refusal to talk to his son in an effort to keep our family together. Yeah, here we go again, Diane. You don't understand. I can't quit her. You had that improv thing in Queens, and I happily cleared my schedule and we decided to take the LSAT. And remember when you took the FDNY test? And I stayed home every night when you wanted to take science courses because you thought you wanted to be a doctor. I, I didn't know that I pass out when I see blood or skeletons or like other doctors. Stay away from me. Uh, we had this Airedale Terrier named Dimashia. She's bad. Slept in Charles' bed. Well, that's it. <laughs> what? No, Greg! You really say it out loud? I'll explain it. A setup is a piece of information that travels along in a linear fashion that is a twist on the end, an incongruity. We call that the punchline. I'll give you a perfect example. I've been married twice. I was widowed by my first wife, divorced by my second wife, or as I sometimes say, my first wife died and my second wife wouldn't. Okay, look at that. Comes along like this. I mean, the way you talk to her, the amount of time she's forgiven you for the things you've done, how she's been your advocate at every turn, all these years. This is an exciting time for you. I'm gonna have it shipped here. I'm gonna save a ton on Jersey sales tax. It's coming on Wednesday. Anne's gonna be here to sign for it, right? I mean, what time? How should I know? You'll get a delivery time window, guy. The mailman's not gonna drop Could it. Could be a woman? Or a male maid. No. It's not male maid. It's milk maid. Or male Mail carrier. I think it's male carrier. Mail carrier. Which is just universal. If he doesn't think of it on his own, I'm gonna remind him every chance I get. You are so pathetic. God, you are so jealous of your brother. You can't even stand to see him happy. Jealous of yes. Greg? Yes. <laughs> He's got nothing I want. He has everything that you want. Let's just mix that together. If you have any boulders like that that are resistant, just break them apart. See a couple there, stick them together. All right, mix it around real good. And let's bring in that milk mixture there. It's crazy. Because like sometimes we get a ladies night out and that's fine. And what's great about ladies night out is fucking nothing. Okay? Because by the end of the night, one of you will be sitting in the corner of the table just going, I know, I know!